Hi, Briquette here with a full walkthrough of LEGO Dimensions The Goonies Level Pack. I also uploaded a much shorter video with just the mini kits and rescue. There's an end card for that that you can click on towards the end of this video. And there's a link in the description below. Hmm. Sloth. Chunk. I also uploaded a video of the building instructions for Sloth's two vehicles. Alright Sloth, my friends are in some real big trouble so we gotta do something. You think you could help me get out of this chair? Sloth, help, Chunk! Yeah, you got it! Sloth, help, Chunk! Oh man, you made a teeter-totter! Let me try! Oh, ow! Oh man, what happened? Huh? Junk? Junk okay? Yeah, Junk's okay. Sl Come on, Sloth. The Fratellis are gonna be after my friends. We gotta find them before it's too late. <laughs> find friends. Find friends. There's gotta be a way back to the room with that old fireplace. That was the last place I saw him. Could've maybe used that to make us some dinner. My mom's gonna be so mad at me for being late. Wait a sec, huh? Now where am I? Give me a sec, Sloth. I'm looking around. Just great. I'm back where I started from. Now what are we gonna do? Yeah. Rockets will never let you down. The first mini kit requires someone with fix it ability. BA Baracus has that. Data does too, but I don't think he's available in this part of the level even the second time around. There ain't nobody better to hold on to this than BA Baracus, especially if it's gold. Haha, <laughs> that counterfeiting machine spitting out money. If this isn't working for you, try aiming a little higher. We did it, Sloth! Man, that was real scary! Chum, be careful with... Yeah! Like you spent through here, all right! For the next mini kit, we need to get past this silver gate. If this is your second time through, you can use the pirate ship. Well, hello, my pretties. We're also going to need the water spray ability. Harry Potter can do that. We're going to need to shoot that guy.
Then we need to smash the chest that falls down. We need to keep turning this turnstile until that pipe connects to the wall. Then quickly we need to spray water into the hole. If we wait too long, the pipe will start to move away from the wall. Then we need to go over there and build the mini kit. When you come up to one of these gold sparkly grapple hooks, you need to hit the right button, and when you swing to the other side, hit the jump button. This part was a little tricky for me. I had to make sure I was actually aiming straight to the right before I jumped. Now right here, as soon as you get control back, you gotta start running to the right or you'll get Stop. smashed. <laughs> the right stick to dive underwater. <gasps> There's the key for the color keystone. One-Eyed Willie's pirate ship can blast the silver on that tentacle.
There's the Chroma Keystone. You get this keystone in the second level of LEGO Dimensions main storyline. You can use three different characters for this, or just one by putting him on the left part of the toy pad when he's yellow, then changing his color to blue and putting him on the right side of the pad, then changing his color to red and putting him on the circle part of the pad. To rescue Rosalita, we're going to need the magic ability. Harry Potter or Gandalf can do that. Hit the right button and then rotate the left stick clockwise. This is the shift keystone which you get in the first level of the main storyline of Dimensions. You'll go through the portal with the color that your character is on on the toy pad. So to get up to that yellow portal, we put our character on the yellow part of the toy pad and step on the button. Then we put our character on the blue side to go over to the blue side. But in this case, it didn't work, maybe because I had another character on the pad. They wanted me to use both characters. When I just had Sloth on the pad, it worked. In that case, just put your other character on the other color. This reveals a strength handle, but only for a few seconds. So if it closes, just pull the switch again when you have sloth ready. Hey, my Uncle Max told me how to do this. <laughs> it's easy, watch. Uh. <gasps> 
hit the right button and then keep hitting it. Hey Ma! That crazy door nearly crushed me! Fire you! Help your brother find his hair! <laughs> hit the right button and then jump. Now here we need the skeleton organ. Hit the tag button and then the right button. And then hit these right when they pass that line. If you wait till they get to the middle of that vertical area, it's too late. Chunk found a sword that he can use to cut these vines. Sloth can use his super strength here. When you see the prompt, hit the left button. That floor looks a little weak, Sloth. You think we could smash it up a little? What was that? Something under the water? Is that an octopus? Aw, oh, man! Why does smashing some stuff help us out while smashing other stuff just gets us into even more trouble? <laughs> yeah, fishy, fishy, fishy. <laughs> Octopus is gonna sink the ship if he doesn't let go. We gotta scare him off somehow. You can use a laser on this to get a bunch of studs, especially the blue and purple ones. The next mini kit needs Silver Lego Blow Up, Cyberman active. which Cyberman has, and he can do it underwater.
The next mini kit is two rooms over to the right. We need someone with laser ability. We need to get the scale on the left side. You call that a wand? This is a wand. I need to analyze this back in the lab. That light blue means we need sonar smash ability, and we can do that with the skeleton organ. <laughs> this is the locate keystone which we get in the fifth level of the main storyline of Dimensions, called Painting the Town Black. We hit it and then walk around until we find the white diamond looking thing. Then we hit the right button, and then hit it a bunch of times. Hey! Hey! What happened? How did it even... I mean... Oh, hey! Never mind, look at all that gold! <laughs> gold! Maybe there's even more above us, Sloth! Let's go! <gasps> Shh! Quiet! <gasps> The next mini kit is underwater. We need to smash three of these treasure chests. They kind of take a while to smash. <laughs> We need to rescue those five people shown above, and this will help rescue the two on the bottom row. We need Data's Fix-It ability for this. for the next rescue. Looks like a job for data! Thanks, Scott. My dad might be 
might be Mad Jack, but I ain't crazy enough to stick around here. Woohoo! <laughs> bye bye! <laughs> we did it, Dana! All right, you little pipsqueaks. Fun time's over. Ooh. How'd you like that one, huh? Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, get back here! We have to fight him before we can do the next rescue. He's pretty tough at first, but you can see his heart's going away. There's another one. You gotta get in front of him and knock him down. Now we need the skeleton organ to blast this glass with the sonar smash ability. Not over yet. Hey! Hey guys! Help! I'm stuck in here! Mikey! Hold on! We'll get you out of that thing somehow. Now we have another chroma keystone. So we smash guys, that. It's dark in here! I don't want to run out of uh, hydrogen! Hydrogen? You mean oxygen? Oxygen, yeah, that's what I said. Oxygen. I knew we'd find one eyed Willie's treasure, but I didn't think I'd end up like one of his crew. Now we need data again for this terminal. Then we need to grab onto this grapple hook and pull on it. First we hit the right button and then we hold down the left button. If you stop swinging and you need to start again, just hold the left stick to the right until you start swinging enough to jump over there. The key for the chroma keystone is on the front of that chest. Red on the left, yellow on the right, and blue on top in the circle. And since he's red and he was already on the left side of the toy pad, that part's done. Now that he's yellow, we put him on the right side of the toy pad. We need to blast that silver. So if you have a character that can do that, great. Otherwise, use the ship. Huh? I got some use. Now you can only use characters that you have a physical minifigure for. You can't use Data or Chuck. So now that he's blue, we put him on the circle part of the toy pad. And there's another rescue. Now for this battle, wait until he shoots all six of his bullets and then go for him. You can hear him clicking the gun <laughs> when it's empty. Guess this means no encore for me. Guys, guys, over here! You gotta get me out of this thing! And that's the last rescue. So we're ready to move on to the next section. He stands in there and hits the right button.
You'll need Doctor Who's TARDIS for the next four minikits. First, you need to blast that silver rock. Then we jump in the TARDIS with the tag button, and then we hit the right button. For the next mini kit, we need to smash all these lab tables. We got him, the Viosa. Oh. it's good to go. Now we need Ethan Hunt to play his Fuse mini game. I kept messing up, so it went really slow, so I speeded it up for you guys. <laughs> um. We need wild style to scan this. Then we'll need data, or I think Ethan Hunt will work at this terminal also. For the next mini kit, we need to blast these silver lights to create a master build. We need to smash three of those little green robots for the next mini kit. I didn't even notice that one until I ran into it by accident <laughs> with Wild Style. The bottom right of the screen is telling us to put her on the circle part of the toy pad. Then the right side, then the left side. There's another one of those little green robots. My controls are being overridden. Weapons malfunction. Help me. Now we need someone with the electrical charge. I got the ACU Trooper from Jurassic World. Now we activate the locate keystone. Now we hit the right button and then pump it like crazy. <laughs> oh my giddy old. Bring 
forth more Daleks. My brethren, you must exterminate the intruders. Now we have to blast 20 of these Daleks. For this last mini kit, we're going to need Newt Scamander and his bow truckle lock pick. We watch the bottom right of the screen to see what pattern to move Newt around the toy pad. So the first one is left, right, top. The next one is left, top, right. And the last one is left, top, right, also. <laughs> He's so cute. We need the skeleton organ again. I bet Chester Copperpot never dreamed there'd be so much treasure in this one place. We need to grapple that hook we just built and pull on it. I'd like to see my dad try and fit Willie's pirate ship into the museum. It'd probably just be easier to move. Yeah, that should be enough dynamite, right? I don't know, Data. Maybe we need just a little more to be sure. Data has the illumination ability, so he hits the right button, and then he can see inside this cave. Now he needs silver Lego blow-up ability, which Harry Potter has, or the pirate ship. <laughs> Now we need to go build that pile of stuff that the octopus just threw over there. And that's our third piece of dynamite. We did it! 
That's it, Sloth! You're doing it! Let's get this over with. I'm buying the goondocks. Sign here. Estamos salvados. Estamos salvados. No firme. Señor Walsh, no firme. What's she saying, Mouth? What's she saying? What is it? Estamos salvados. Señor Walsh, estamos salvados. No firme. No firme ese documento. No sign. No sign. No sign. How dare you? Miren esto. Miren lo que encontré. It's asombroso. Dad, we don't have to leave the goondocks. There'll be no signing today. Newsreel? How'd your kids find them? The octopus was very scary. Octopus? Yeah. Yeah, and then when we found the pirate ship. Pirate ship? Yeah, and you see that had the pirate treasure on it. We were getting chased by the Fratellis and... Tell them more tall stories, Lawrence. Oh, no, this time it's for real. How do you think we got the jewels? Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please make like a Lego character and smash that like button and subscribe to see when I upload new videos. See you next time.